kiss you on your tiny forehead. Mwah! What's up everybody and welcome to Backbone. So I saw this game months ago on TikTok and I've been wanting to play it for a while. Uh, and now that our two other series are completed, I'm really excited to play this game for you guys. Uh, we're playing the prologue just to kind of feel things out. But if you guys are interested, I can totally play the full game. Let's get started. Oh, I love pixel art. It is a bit of a hyperfixation of mine. Ah, smoking and reading in the bath. I do the same thing, except I have a tall glass of milk and Dove chocolates sitting on the side of the tub, like a degenerate. Uh, it somehow feels worse than a cigarette. Sorry, Mr. Call. Yeah, no problem. 27 on the buzzer. Just enough time to clean up. <sighs> Takes drag of cigarette. Okay, left, right, E tab. Can do that. Okay, here's our cork board. Um, I'm assuming the dame up at the right is an X gone awry. Uh, the date October 12th is important for some reason. I'm assuming grandpa is in the right corner. Case files. Insurance frauds, stolen cars, estranged lovers. I knew it! I knew it! Should have probably been some of these old case files. I made a joke about next, but I was right! Okay, now I use the mouse. Use the mouse to drag and drop items. Some items can be picked up by pressing E. Okay. Oh! <gasps> I love a little drag and drop. I have literally so many dishes in my sink right now. I cannot judge this raccoon man. Living room. Okay, gotta hit up Frankie to fix it when I have cash, so never. Ugh, my friend. Can this raccoon get any more relatable? Call mom, buy soup, buy soap. I'm hungry, sorry guys. Pay bills, don't die. You know what, that's a very good list. Leaving photo developers in the kitchen is a sure road to poisoning. Or great soup. See, see, soup. I'm on a roll. I'm on the same wavelength as this game. Yo, this dude's got his bathtub in his kitchen? I could have my milk and chocolate so conveniently then. That's awesome. Oh, okay, no, no, I see little toilet. At least you're not crapping in the kitchen. That is nice. Toilet books. The great apes of the great story. Swell toilet read. Oh. Oh, I was supposed to pick up. <laughs> the bowl. All right, let's wash our dirty dishes. This is the pinnacle of the 21st century. I am actively cleaning the dishes of a pixelated raccoon rather than my own. I'll wash these later. Probably not. A man after my own heart. God bless him. Oh, that must be Mrs. Green. Dun dun dun. I'm calling it right now, guys. Uh, Mrs. Green is the killer. Watch me be right. Watch me be right for no reason. Oh. Nice, you have dialogue options. Excuse me. I'm looking for Detective Latour. We spoke on the phone. I get, let's get straight to the point. I gather you have a case for me, Mrs. Green. Oh, that will do. I, um, well, I understand this sort of thing is routine in your line of work. It's about my husband, you see. He's a cheater, ain't he? That's terrible. I'm gonna say I'm listening. He just hasn't been himself lately, getting home at odd hours, making weird excuses. You try to talk to him about- let's be- let's offer helpful advice. Yes, but he gets difficult, like it's my fault. Listen, I just need to know if you can get proof of his infidelity. I need it for the court. Oh, filing for divorce, she needs proof. That's right. Above all, I need something damning enough that custody won't even be a question. Okay. Husband will want the kids. I, I can't take any chances anymore. Let's get, let's ask a bunch of questions. He was always a private kind of man. Now he started getting home late, missing work, and smelling funny. Oh, what kind of smell? Like perfume, and not mine. Alcohol, smoke, and something poignant. A kind of herbal stink. That za. He's skipping work. I've had calls from his boss, wondering if he was sick. I even covered for him. 
I'm so fed up with this. How late are we talking? Way past the kids' dinner time. I asked what he was doing. It didn't go well. Oh, domestic violence? I can't see how this is pertinent, Mr. Lotor. Yeah, no, I need to know if the dude's violent if I'm gonna be going after him. I have to know if he's dangerous. Fine, he has a mean temper, unpredictable. That's all you need to know. He threatened to take the kids. He has threatened to take them, yes. Daisy and Elliot shouldn't have to go through all this. I'm doing what it takes to protect their future. Let's be, th let's be sympathetic. Uh, oh, Dad, it's not your fault. I know, you're right. Thank you for sharing, I know this came easy. Yes, I'm finally being brave, for them at least. Let's nail this bird. I'm taking the case. Sure, what do you need to know? Yeah, what does he look like? Here's a photo. He's an otter, of course. I don't approve of interspecies marriage. He wears glasses, square ones, in his wedding band as far as I know. Oh, and he carries a black briefcase to and from work. Where would I find him? Usually at work or at home. He never used to stop anywhere. Now it's all the time. Have you met any of his friends? Nobody's mentioned a few guys. Say they get together after work sometimes. How would I pick him out of a crowd? He wears a suit to work. I picked out his green tie and hat for him today. What's his name? Any aliases? Jeremy Green. I think people at work call him Jez. Where does he work? At the Wolf Bank on Granville. I'll write the address down for you. That should be enough. There's just a matter of my fee. I can give you a hundred now and fifty when you bring the photos. Will that suffice? Yes, plus any unexpected expenses. Please be careful. Nobody can know we spoke. If this gets out, I'm as good as dead. You can trust me, Odette. Yeah. Let's get started, baby. Oh, that was mama, not grandpa. That was a masculine looking raccoon, my bad. I was right. Ah, Pianetti, you beautiful, dangerous renegade you. Maybe one day you'll settle down and call me again. I knew it. <laughs> okay, well, most of our food is grown. Stuff gets made. No one's idea of paradise. Lower middle classville. Granville, where the night comes to life. It's got rough edges, but it feels like home. <laughs> home to the high and mighty. Skyscrapers full of apes. Big shots and gated communities that can keep it. Ah, Gastown. That's a dream. Well, if you're a bourgeois snob who dreams of overpriced salad, it's nice and clean, though. My diploma project. Places of absolute solitude. Only action my camera sees these days is snapping fools, leaving places they shouldn't be in. All right, let's find this vagabond. I love that the loading screen is a smoked cigarette. Ooh, I love this art style. And the music, oh my gosh. Let's go. I'm loving this so far. This is a-okay. All right. Granville smells like wet concrete. Overpriced fast food in puke, my kind of battleground. Oh, this is... Oh, hold shift to run. Uh-oh, I'm a little worried about why we would need to run. Oh, there's a squirrel. Yo, old man. Take a look at this photo. Have you seen this guy around? Nah, man. Even if I had... Why would I tell you? <laughs> See ya. See ya. <laughs> I ain't gonna bother him. Hey, if it isn't Mr. Howie, what's a rascal like you up to on a fine evening like this? Oh yeah, okay, this guy seems to know me, so we'll open a little bit softer this time. My beaver. How are Estrella and the kid? They're both doing just fine. Essie and I are good. Great even. We even bless the shepherd. Got a second lad due soon. Oh, I got a great story for you. Wow, yeah, I'm not gonna tell him, hey, you have too many children. Like, bro, that's not my place. Another, you guys are lucky. Thanks, he's a big one too. As he is round as a watermelon. Anyway, the story I tell it, ha, woman, you get any bigger and I won't fit you in the trunk of the car. Uh, can you answer a couple of my questions first? How he, how he's up? What's so important you can't tell, let a friend tell his story? I'm looking for a guy. Here's the photo, seen him recently. I don't know, Howie. I see so many faces. I know those scrawny sorts like flashing the cash at the bite, though. Have you seen him there? 
I don't look like the kind of guy to be in there. I see you'd have my balls. Anyway, Howie, you're scaring off my clients, you know? All right, thanks, Anatoly. I don't, I'll see you around. I don't know if I'm saying that name correctly. Oh, I love all the background stuff happening. It's so delightful. They did a great job restoring the rogue. If people watch more movies, maybe the world wouldn't be so sad. Canines, cocktails, and a movie. Sounds like a great plan for the weekend, actually. Ah, uh, I just love how everything's- there's so much to look at. Eden Simmons is the hottest new jazz star. See her tonight, only at the bite. Wolfbank, is this where Green works? Yep, that's it. There's a- okay, we can talk to his friends. Yeah. Uh, how are you doing this pleasant evening? You folks work at, work at the Wolf Wolfbank, right? Sure, we'll go for this option. Yeah, why? Take a look at this photo. Have you seen this man? Oh, is Jez? Let's just be familiar. Act like we know what's going on. Is Jez around? And who are you? Wallace asshole owes me money. I've been looking. Ooh, this is a good choice here. Should I create a reason to, to see him? Oh, there's a cool raindrop effect on the screen. I like that. Let's go with the lie. You and me both, pal. <laughs> oh, God. And Derek, good luck getting it back anytime soon. Oh, he'll pay if I could find him, see him today. Today, but the wimp ass left early. He's scared Derek's gonna split his wig. Something happened at work. Heard his contract is not getting- Oh, he lost his job because he kept not coming in. Bastard had it coming. She boy spends time with him outside of work. Yeah, we used to have a blast at the bite every Thursday and he turned into a needy leech. The bite? Could he be there now? How the F should I know? Now skedaddle, rack. That felt- that, that felt like it was said in a- in a slur sort of way. Ooh, here's the bite. I definitely wouldn't fit into that crowd. Wouldn't want to. Damn! So there's just a straight up racist, speciesist caste system? No entrance for raccoons. Goodbye. Perhaps a couple of loons would change your mind. My friend Carlos is waiting inside. Go ask him. I'm sure you want to arrange something, big boy. What do you need? Understandable. Let's explore for a bit. Let's explore for a bit. See what we can do. Oh, alleyway. Maybe we can sneak in the back? Ooh, hey, buddy. So it would seem that rodents are on the bottom of the food chain in this, like, world. And, like, any- as you get closer and closer to, like, human-like, like, apes and stuff, I think it gets, like, higher and higher status in this world. I'm just guessing at this point, though. Howard, well, I'll be damned. It's been a while. Wow, Larry. Larry, what are you doing here? How you doing, old man? You're calling me old. You should look in a mirror. <laughs> Haha, <laughs> right, that's fair, plus these rags likely don't help my appearance any. So, do you live here? Are you okay? Not really. Thank you, though. Now, what's your deal? Have you seen any an otter guy around here recently? What do you do? Awful things to his pregnant wife. Can't tell Clan Con- Ah, let's, let's respect the privacy. Must be a shifty guy. What's he like? Uh, here's a photo. Haven't seen him, sorry. Let me know if you need anything. <laughs> I'm here often, hear people talk. I gotta leave, but the bouncer won't let me into the bite. Tough break. It's really more of a cat and dog crowd in there. You said you guys an honor? That's weird. Have any ideas of how I could get in? What you could do is ask Johnny. He'd know better than me. Who's Johnny? Squirrel kid with the leather jacket. He's a pusher. I don't entirely know what his deal with the bite is, but they're chummy. What sort of stuff does Johnny push? Yeah, typical, like Hype and Shadow Fang. Oh, get this, he started rolling out something called Monkey Butt. Who comes up with these names? It's like they don't need, want you to do drugs. Uh, Monkey Butt? Yeah, where does this new thing's the shit? Though, perhaps a little bit less figuratively than one might wish, stanky thing. Does it have a kind of herbal stink? No, first-hand experience, but I guess that could be a more delicate way to put it. Okay, so yeah, so... <laughs> this guy we're looking for is on Monkey Butt. Uh, and you think... What do you know about the bite? Owned as a Bloodworth, so a lot of rumors floating around about the whole ordeal. Bloodworth, the bear family. Crime family, last year, head of the family, up and died, and shit hit the fam. Ha heir ended up in prison, and the current owner's a rel- What are the rumors? What are the rumors? Oh, all kinds of bush bullshit. How she's got an ape for a lover, or that she was the one who got all the others killed so she could take over. And you think this Johnny guy'd help? 
might take some convincing, but it's chill. I've seen him help people cut the line. His clients, I think. All right, hopefully that's enough to get me into the bite. Thanks. You got it, Howard. Welcome to Stract and Really. See you soon. Sure, Larry. Thank you, and I'll see you. Okay. Luscious. $14.99 for a trim. I'll stick to the mirror. A pair of scissors and a large whiskey. Yeah, getting hammered and cutting hair. Uh, that sounds like a great idea. Oh, control. Ah, oh, crap. Downey's on duty in the booth up ahead. I can't deal with him right now. Do I just crawl under? <laughs> okay. Oh, I love all these buildings and the reflections and like effects and stuff are so cool. Rich people clothes. One sock is more expensive than my whole outfit. Nice. Joxy Burger. Oh god, I love all these buildings. Once I got punched by a guy in, the fedor in a fedora, then puked all over my new coat. Ah, memories. Garbage bin, let's see, socks, takeaway boxes. I'm acting like a raccoon and dealing out of the tr digging out of the trash can. Let's see, socks, takeaway boxes, cigs, aha, take it to the bite. Thanks, trash bin. Oh, see, that's why you look ahead. Oh, Bo. Good day to you, friend. Fancy some fresh news. Anything happening for a change? For a loon, you can read them all with your eyeballs. I just want the headline. Front page today are all great ape parade preparations underway. Celebration starts Friday. Thanks, man. See you around. All right. Yo, old man. You, Johnny. Who's asking? Uh, I am. Yeah, I'm Johnny. What's it to you? I need to get into the fight. Let's just lead with, like, let's not lead with, um, maybe uh, we should get into, like, a I scratch your back, you scratch mine situation, maybe. Need to get into the bike. I'll bet you do, pal. Why should I care? I'm a detective. My target is inside that club. I heard that say a monkey bump through you. Listen, I heard this place go for the good shit. Uh, number two sounds vaguely threatening, but that could be what we need. Uh, let's use the information we got. The fuck? Where did you get that stupid idea, Striper? That was a slur. That is for sure a slur in this universe. Just a rumor that's going around, so will you help me out? Look, old man, you couldn't handle that stuff even if I did have it. Hey, kid, just get me into the fight, will you? What's in it for Johnny? Johnny gets to not be introduced to the cops. Ha <laughs> uh, this one's too funny, but I don't want to, like, force him into it because what if he turns on me. I don't want to promise him anything though. I'm gonna say Johnny gets to not be introduced to the cops. Tread lightly, punk. I'll take you into an alley and fuck you up if you're not careful. See that police dog down the street? I bet Johnny would love to sniff your pockets. You feel me? Is that a promise? <laughs> Are you on something right now? Trust me, I'm not. I don't trust snipers, let alone one in trench coats. Bit rich coming from a bushy-tailed corner boy, don't you think? Jeez Louise. <laughs> Johnny, look into my eyes. Do you look like do they look like the eyes of a liar to you? Yeah, so all I see is a filthy trash monster who drinks alone and cries over his dirty magazines every night, probably lives with his mama too. And the trench coat is just the final pitiful cherry on top of a crap cake. Weird hearing that from a fellow with so much fur gel that he literally sticks the walls, don't you find? Shut your mouth or I'll stuff your trash tail in it. At least my mother isn't busting her gut in the farmlands. <laughs> Fuck you, I'll get you in, but only so you overdose get eaten alive by feral geese. Meet me at the entrance, fool. After you. <laughs> I definitely did not play that the right way. I played that the funny way. Hey, Johnny. Oh, you brought my favorite customer. Striper, you can come in. Don't cause any trouble. Thanks, go inside. I think we explored everything, so yeah, let's go inside. Are we gonna see ant furry strippers? Oh no, this is classy. Jazz, alcohol, beautiful canine ladies, all a little too high end for my taste. Cool, okay. We got people to talk to. Well, you're unusual. Not unlike, I'll take that as a compliment. Let's be sassy, I wanna be sassy today. I'll take that as a compliment. As you will, though it was just an observation. Renee Wilson. Should I say? Ooh, ooh. Yes! Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, does this matter? Wallace, please meet you. Mm, that's a fake name? You're too young for a Wallace. Calling it, that's a line. You have said that no matter what name I gave. Ooh, but I really like- Well, I'm Wallace tonight, and you'll be screaming that fake name all night long! Well, I'm Wallace tonight. Delightful. Do I detect sarcasm? Ever got tricked by a raccoon before? What is that, a pickup line? Do I detect- <laughs> 
I forgot Trick by Raccoon 4. You're my first. Let's celebrate some time. Take my card. Is that a fake card? To what end, I wonder. Renee Wilson is a mask. You wear it well, but your true persona is slipping through the cracks. The intrigue. What am I running away from? You got tangled in some illegal affair. Oh, do tell me more. Maybe I'll write a piece about it. Maybe later. I'm gonna keep the card. By all means, if you run into something newsworthy, you know who to call. An investigative journalist. How's that gig? It's a living, usually. Hey there. You here for Eden Simmons' show, too? I'm so happy to see her live, finally. I haven't heard of her before. Has a nice sound, though. Yeah, let's, let's be chill. Let's be chill. Well, I'm probably a bit biased, but yeah, she's great. You sound like a big fan. I got a record player just for her. She's mostly all I listen to. Have you been here before? What makes her great? Does she, what makes her great? She's an incredible vocalist. She also plays everything herself. Brings a record for live shows. So talented. Have you been here before? <laughs> nah, my mom doesn't approve of the place. Had to do a bit of sneaking to be here tonight. How come? You don't mind me asking. Uh, I don't think she stepped foot in a bar her entire life. They're all sleazy dens in her mind. Sounds like it was worth it. It's good music. Ha, well, you can only be sure if you stay for the whole show. Uh, let's try to get a look at the photo. Uh, let me think. I think I saw someone like that walk in. Uh, did you see where he went? He talked to the lady in the jade-colored dress and then went upstairs, I think. Prostitution. Oh, uh, was it? No, it's probably the drugs, actually. Uh, is he a green hat? Oh, yes. Yeah, so is his tie? Do you have a briefcase? I'm not sure. I'm sorry. Thanks and enjoy the show. So he might not have a briefcase with him. Ooh, Jade Dress. Oh, this game might make me a furry. Isn't this dreamy? Listen, I'm looking for someone. Well, shoot. <laughs> excuse me. Damn, that's laying on really thick right away. Uh, excuse me? God, I love this music. Wanna dance with me? I'm looking for my friend Otter. Have you seen him? Wanna dance with me? Sorry, no. Ugh. Ouch, I should not have. Ah, that was painful. Just how casually I was just rejected. Uh, can you at least answer a couple of questions for me? Alright, yeah. Not really. Leave me alone, okay? Sorry to bother you. Jeez, Louise, what was the point of that interaction? This is Jade Dress. Evening, sugar. Enjoying yourself? Uh, ooh. No, because he's already been here, so I wouldn't say not yet. My friend's late. I'm worried about him. In here, how could I not be? We aim to please. So you work here. Sure, honey, but not for the likes of you. The VIPs, then. For a certain class of customer. Dedicated ones. And what does dedication earn? You tell me. Better yet, come back when you know. What do you like to do after hours? Um, I'd hope you know better than to proposition me. Um, just curious, everyone has hobbies. If they have time. I used to take photos. I'm a photographer too, what a coincidence. Oh, for whom? Oh, uh, nothing you'd know. Try me, what catches your eyes? That's horny, that's creepy. This one? Edgy, what do you shoot on? A Leica, crime lens? I'm into it. Used to have a Leica too. Maybe you'll pick it up again. I wouldn't count on that. It never leaves you. Don't try to explain things to me. Of course, miss... Call me Ingrid, Mr... How rude of me, Wallace. Mr. Wallace, I hope we see you again soon. Okay, don't didn't really get too much out of that. Hello, look at this gorgeous polar bear woman. Woo, big old tooties. You look a little lost. Is that obvious? I'm running out of voices, okay guys? I'm running out of voices, There's too many voices. You look a little lost. Is it's that obvious? It is to me. It's not my usual scene. Oh no, I like this. You, however, seem right at home. I practically am. Wouldn't you say so, boy? First name terms with the bartender, too, huh? Allow me to formally introduce myself. I'm Clarissa Bloodworth. I own the bite. What? Well, allow me to say... Oh, this is the woman we were just talking about with the dude in the alley. Well, allow me to say you've got a very cozy place here. 
Thanks, I do strive to offer a sophisticated experience here, so to whom do I owe the pleasure? I gotta tell everyone the same name. Name's Wallace. The pleasure's mine, Wallace, and what's your profession? Mmm. I'm gonna say a half-truth. Half-truths are the most safe. A creative soul expresses, so how can I help, darling? Well, you're the expert. Do you have any special recommendations? Folks say that our chef's special is to die for, but I pride myself on everything here being equally special. So what brought you here tonight? Okay, I'm not gonna go right in to be like, Do you guys offer prostitution? Yeah, let's start loose here and meet a friend. Is that so? More of a regular than you? Sure is. Always talking the place up. What's his name? If he's here tonight, I'll know. Uh, yeah, I'll just, yeah, see, that was a softer way to introduce it, instead of just being like, Have you seen this man? And you were meeting him for a quiet drink? Uh, yeah, we got a lot of catching up to do. Darling, I think you're lying to me. Why would I be lying? Mr. Wallace, if that is your real name, playing coy clearly doesn't suit you, and it's certainly not appropriate in my establishment. I suggest you take your business elsewhere. I'd rather stay. Oh, I must insist, or should I ask Hank to insist instead? He can be, oh, so persuasive when he's angry. No need, I'm blowing this joint. Thank you, perhaps me and the real you will see each other again sometime. Don't count on it. Did I say something wrong, or was that always going to happen? Where's Broadway? What's her deal? I need to find another way in. Let's see. How'd it go? Did you find him? Got kicked out. Oh, Howard, how do you manage that? I think I poked the bear. Doesn't matter. So they use a the backdoor for deliveries, right? Now hold up, you said you didn't get into cases like this anymore, and you told me that you had no first-hand experience with monkey butt. People don't change, Larry. Look, I'm sorry, I shouldn't have brought that up. Yeah, that was too much. Oh, you're right. Probably reek of this stuff, too. Listen, I'm no one to judge. I'm just trying to explain. Don't explain things to me, Howard. I'm happy to help, but this is where we draw the line. I hear you. How do I get back in? The truck over there just arrived, and some fellows entered through the back door. I also heard voices coming from the roof, so they must have a door up there. Tell me about the back door. They have a little intercom box. You ring, they pick up, and if you're someone they're expecting, they buzz you in. Any clue on how I could be someone they're expecting? No idea. Maybe they use some sort of code? You're the detective, not me. Tell me about the door on the rooftop. Well, most of these old buildings have one. Problem is, how are you gonna get on the roof? Is there a fire escape? You could give me a lift. Nah, no fire escape, and the bite is too high. And there... Are there any smaller structures you could climb first? The press stand. Whoa there! That could work! Start with the press stand, go to Mackenzie, and proceed along the roofs. But you should know that Bo is kind of a dick nugget. It's the most accurate description of Bo I've ever heard in my life. Is he though? He seems kind of neutral to me. Who's Bo? I can't remember who Bo is. Weird. Maybe he's gone blind and didn't register as you as a raccoon. Anyway, I'd suggest talking to him and see if he'd be up for it. Okay, Bo. I gotta talk to Bo. Okay. Oh, this is a new person. Feeling peckish? I've got sweet and savory. You can mix and match. Make your own trail mix. How about it? Sorry, do you hang around Greenville? Often do you have unshilled pumpkin seeds? Of course, get salted and unsalted. Each bag is worth a half a loon, but I'll give you three for a loon. It's a deal. I'll have one say. You hang around Granville often. I'm here from time to time. Can I help you with something, sir? I need to find a way in the bite. The fancy jazz bar? I assume you tried the front door. I got kicked out through the front door. Oh, uh, maybe this back door. I really don't know the place very well. Sorry. Itching to ask something. Go ahead. Uh, why'd you get kicked out, sir? They didn't like that I was snooping around. Got an argument, turned into a fight. They didn't like I was snooping around. Why were you snooping around? I owe some money to the bartender. Didn't know it would be your ship. Met someone special, and they're inside that bar. Ooh, a love story. I love love. I'll tell you more if you tell me how to get in. Sorry, sir. Really wish I could help. I would if I could swear. But I was being truthful before. I don't know anyone to get in. Ever been to the rooftops? Uh, no, sir. I wish I could be more help, but I've never been up there myself. I don't know. No problem, kid. Thanks. Is this Bo? Yeah, this is Bo. Back so soon, one now. Uh, don't mind me. I just need to climb the stand. Hey, Bo. I was hoping you... Yeah, don't just start climbing the stand. I'll get pissed. I don't know. I'm quite busy. Won't take a minute. Just need to climb the stand. Absolutely not. Do you know how much time and effort it takes to keep the stand in good condition? Come on, boy. I need this for work. What if I could offer something in return? Now you mentioned it. Maybe you could help out with a little issue I've been having. Spill it. I need that seed selling Pika Hawker off the Granville. Can you do that? I don't know, Bill. That's not what I do. Oh, no. Scratch back. Mine. Yours. If that's what's gonna... Oh, no. He was nice. If that's what's gonna take. You're lucky I'm desperate. Wish me luck. No, do I really have to do this? Is this the only way? Hey there, back for more. Listen, I have a strange favorite to ask. Hey, Sid, not quite. I have a strange favorite to ask. What's up? Could you leave Granville at least for tonight? Uh, I'd rather not. Thing is, Granville's a great sell spot this time of night. Bo wants you off his turf. 
quote unquote. Oh, well, of course he does. He thinks we're rivals. Well, screw him. What, what did he promise you? Uh, to allow me to climb his press stand. Excuse me, why? I really don't have time to explain. Could you do me a favor? Uh, it's for my job. I can't tell you much. Secret's fine, but how do we get rid of Bo instead? How about- Oh, actually, I'm down with this. I'm listening. Bo thinks he owns Granville because he has a paid-up permanent spot. Permit spot? I'm just playing the hand I've been dealt. My mom and I built this cart with our bare hands. I'm just trying to help my family. Where's this going? Bo's a bigot. He hates my guts because I'm a ro young rodent boy doing better than him. I'm a good boy. What's the kicker? Did you know Bo sells adult magazines? Very naughty, illegal ones. Let him know you know, you know? Think he'll buy it? He'll blink. Anything to protect his precious permit. Let's team up. Actually... Let's get this bully off ground. Yeah, no, this guy, Bo's an asshole, and he's a, a racist, so yeah. That's what I like to hear, mister. Go talk to him. I'll b bow to the shepherd for you. I guess the shepherd is god in this universe. Heck yeah, I'm so glad we get to be mean to this bigot anyway, in instead of the poor little m mouse boy. Well, you got rid of that parasite? I think you should leave, Bo. Ha <laughs> what? Heard a rumor. There's a police raid coming up. Uh, are you selling adult magazines? What? Me? No! Adult? What? No! We both know it's not allowed. That boy, I will whoop his ass until it's blue. That damn rodent stealing my business from me, an honest salesman! Bo, I will t just leave, please. During my peak performance hours so you could climb my kiosk, you sneaky bastard, is that it? It's not about me. It's about justice. You! Everything's always about you! Going around, snitching on people, getting on their nerves, undercutting honest businessmen like myself. I'm going then, police officer. If I won't s snitch, said Will. I'm gonna play it kind of cool towards both of them. And who said he won't tomorrow? Degenerates, ruin my whole evening. What a treat to live a lawful life among trash like you. That's just rude. I'm calling the police. Officer, wait, I'll leave. Asshole, damn you and your whole kind. See, racist, racist. Let's climb. Off we go. Man, the, the, those open fires. Who's the top dog now, Foxy Burger? Suck it. It's so dystopian to see those just open flames burning. Oh, the city skyline is very cool. Oh, this look, this game looks really beautiful. Damn, what a view. Guess there are benefits to risking your life on rain-slicked rooftops. Don't mind me, boys. I love pigeons. They're cute little pink feet. They're so gosh darn cute. Wish I could stay here. Maybe the pigeons would accept me as one of their own. It's a very relatable thought. All right, Green. After all that, you better be in here, you bastard. Ooh, let's go! Oh my gosh! Ooh! A dressing room. Thanks, Shepard. It's empty. Okay, no turning back now. Inspect mirror table. Ooh, I can pick stuff up. Nicely wrapped gift. Mine usually comes in recycled newspaper. Margaret Moore is everything right now. Fierce lady, not really my type, though. Bro, no one asked. Happy birthday, Rose. I hope they give you a day off. Note, some honey for your tea. Mum swears by it. Greg, who's Greg? Nice fella. Um, okay, is there anything else to inspect in here? No, let's go through the door and hopefully not get murdered. Press control to crouch. Enemies can't hear you when you crouch and don't see you behind dark objects. Sneaky, sneaky. Just gotta keep my profile low and take a peek into one of the rooms. Jez must be there. Jez is getting the... The sloppity toppity. Oh, 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 oh. Did I mess up? I think I messed up. Yikes. I think that rat saw me. Oh, I love the painting on the right. That's a famous painting. Oh. Oh, Mr. Rat. The rat's gonna get me. Oh, oh, dude, 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 dude. Oh. Oh, okay, so he has like little rounds. That's a naked cat. Okay, so he has rounds that he does. Okay, so I can get pa I thought he was just noticing me every time, but he was on a, like a, a loop. So I just have to wait till I guess he goes past me again and then I can shoot by him. Yes. Toodaloo, toodaloo, toodaloo. Ooh, private room. Damn, did I miss him? Maybe he left something that could help Odette. There's a green tie stuck behind the frame. How to get there? What the? A secret lift? Oh, he's in some deep, deep doo doo. Green must have been here. Now, where's the rest of him? Is this monkey butt? It really does stink like a butt. Okay, so I think 
This is a lot deeper than ordinary vices. I think I could squeeze into it. Not that I particularly want to, but I can't afford to be picky. Let's do it. I think Mr. Green is involved in some seriously bad business. Uh, that's a grim looking furnace. What are they burning in there? Mr. Green? No going back now. Let's do it, baby. Oh, did we go up? Oh, we did. Looks like the guests of the bite are eating well. Corkboard, Greg, the inventory was off again. If I catch you stealing food, I'll chop off your grabby little fingers. Oh, that's Greg. Okay. That was the guy that left the note about the tea earlier. Or was the guy that gave the tea. Intercom. Dial. Kitchen. Leave. Door. and open vent. I can fit through it if I crouch. Okay, let's not do anything until we know what we need to do here. Okay, let's just go through the vent. Ooh, gotta make sure I'm not seeing other guys with big knives. It smells delicious, though. Okay, so I distract him with the mixer. How long does that- how much time do I have time? Okay, so I got a good solid few seconds to do that. Ooh, many conveniently placed mixers. <laughs> How delightful. No one's gonna be like, why the hell are all these mixers being turned on? What about, turn on this mixer? But he ignores that mixer, so I don't understand what the point is. Okay, so it seems like I can't distract one of the cats with the mixer, so we can try the, I guess the intercom? Let's see, dial freezer. They're in the kitchen. Yo, this is a kitchen. What do you need if that's Greg? No, I'm not making you a snack. Uh, how are you doing? I want a large, <laughs> a large pizza, pineapple on top. Pineapple on pizza, are you crazy? Wait, who is this? Don't go anywhere. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah, uh, somebody's coming. Yep, I know. That's why I'm running away. Excellent, excellent, excellent. And now we make this cat distracted. Good day, Mr. Cat. Goodbye. And then we whoop de doo da Right past them. Some kind of locker room. Better keep moving. Inspect locker real quick. Let's see. Let's see. What do we have here? Ooh. <gasps> wait. 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 <gasps> I love these things. I love these things. Where do they belong? Okay, let's... I think if we match them based on size... A, one, four, wait, where does this one go? Okay, A, one, okay. I mean, I'm assuming this is a code, but I don't know how you tell the order. Um, a note. Greg, the turkey is missing again. It had better be where, here, when I get back. Greg is just causing problems. Maybe it's my ticket out of here. It seems to need a turnkey. Let's try that, A, V, A, one. Oh, wait, no, there's only numbers. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh, I'm absolutely racking my brain over here and I can't figure out what it is. Oh, wait a second, wait a second, wait a second. So this is what we're looking at. This only fits on this. I can't find a way to rotate it. So this has to fit on this. This has holes. Bro. Yeah, lines up with this corner. So we got zero down here. I'm just, I'm, I gotta find out. Zero, five, four. It's this one that's tripping me out. Oh, it was, okay, zero, five, four, one. Or some combination of those four. What about 1450? Uh. Bro. How many? <laughs> zero, five, four. Five, four, one, zero, five, four, one, zero. Oh, I got it. Zero, five, zero, four, five, one. I just had to, it's not a smart lock. So I just kept doing permeations. Okay, it's so cold down here. Where are the lights? Oh boy. Ooh, there's some light. Fucking what? They're selling meat. Oh, that's him. That's our guy. Fuck me, fucking Jez. The corpse offers you no help. Touch the corpse. 
try to a certain death. The body shows no obvious signs of violent death. Just a naked, dead, slightly overweight otter. Maybe they overdosed him. The body lies there still. It's there. Dead. Probably murdered, murdered recently. What in the living fuck am I? Is it the f body? Still blues. That's enough. I'm going. Okay. Jeez. Okay, this is way... Somebody's coming. Quick, I have to... Oh! Oh! Okay, let me run! Let me run! Let me run! Let me run! Uh, dude, did not let me run. Okay, in the container. Woo! Oh, that was close. That was really close. So they're butchering people. So they're overdosing people on monkey butt. And then they're butchering them. And I'm assuming them... I'm assuming selling... Greg here. No, I'm still working on a cut. Ugh, sorry. This is the infamous Greg. Dude, this is so much darker. I was thinking like, oh, like... Is there anything else? Oh, oh, okay, key. The turnkey. Maybe I'll make it out alive. Oh, sorry, Jeremy. Sorry, old buddy, old PL. I should definitely not be running. Why am I running? What is wrong with me? Why am I running? Why are you running? Okay. Yeah, hopefully I make it out alive. Start and think maybe not. Okay, we got the key. Dude, so they're like... No wonder she... Okay, yeah, I can escape. Well, can I go this way? No, okay. I'm not... They don't allow me to be dumb. They don't allow me to be dumb. Wow, that was dark, dude. I'm having a freaking panic. Oh, yeah, I threw up. Yeah, I'm having a freaking panic attack. Like, how do you process that? They're like butchering people and probably selling the meat. Because he said processing. I'm still processing one. So, who knows who they're selling that meat to? And it's people. It's people. Oh! Wow. All right. Well, that was the prologue of Backbone. That was much darker than I thought it would be. Um, but really, it looked beautiful. And I liked how they let you have some really snarky dialogue options without penalizing you too much. I liked that a lot. Art style is freaking gorgeous. If you guys want to see me play the rest of this, I don't know, I saw some mixed reviews on Steam. People were saying that the prologue is really good, but the rest of the game doesn't pan out so great. So I might not dive too deep into this one, but if you guys really want me to, I can give it a shot. Thank you guys so much for watching. I make TikToks on TikTok and I post art on Instagram. I do a lot of stuff, follow the links. Chase, chase the rabbit holes, find the cool stuff I do. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you next time. Goodbye.